Hey, Impact friends. I hope you guys are having an absolutely amazing week. I hope you guys are home safe and well with your family. And I hope you guys are ready to have a holiday weekend. So this week we have um, our weekly devotions. However, I want to talk about strength, faith, and love this week. I'm going to be reading out of the book of Ephesians, and it's one of Paul's prayers. And he says, I pray that from his glorious unlimited resources, he will empower you with inner strength through his spirit. Then Christ will make his home in your hearts as you trust in him. Your roots will grow down into God's love and keep you strong. So this was Paul's second prayer for the Ephesians. And he asked God from his glorious and limited resources to equip them with the spirit and to give them everything they need to honor him in his lives. So, and he also asked for strength to do it. So I'm sure that we are all making prayers to God right now about strength, um, about taking our anxiety levels down, um, to make our faith stronger because we haven't been in a church building in months or just to have a positive attitude and be able to love, love other people through this thing. So Paul prays for the church to receive inner strength. So imagine what could happen if we did it. I'm pretty sure God will give it to us. So Paul's prayer should be a part of our life. You know, our faith is tested a lot in everyday life, especially over the last couple months. We're worshiping online. We're worshiping from home. We're not able to see our church family. We're not able to go to our jobs. We're not able to go to school or do anything that says normality in any reason. So being able to pray to God for the strength to get through that and being able to have a God to pray to is pretty amazing, especially one as awesome as ours. <laughs> and being able to really understand that with our faith, we can get through anything. And imagine if we pass that to other people. Imagine what that could do. Spreading kindness all over the place. I mean, sprinkle that everywhere because it's really important and people need it. So I really hope and pray that this prayer, that this prayer from Paul um, will find an expression in our church. It cannot be seen in what's going on right now because we're not in the building, but it is being seen our love and strength and community all over the place right now because our church is deployed. We're not in the building. So I hope you guys have a great week and stay safe. And we cannot, cannot, cannot tell you enough that we miss you and we cannot wait to be back in worship with you. Bye guys.